Yeah. All right, Ron Futrell here, Liberty.com, Tea Party HD with Herman Kane. Yes, you are throwing your hat in the ring for the big office, aren't you, Herman? Proud for consideration. Now let's make sure we okay. get that right. Proud for consideration. You understand the proud for part. Prayerful, prayerful consideration. The considerations certainly. are three things. You know, quietly generating a grassroots organization to be able to support me if I make the decision to run. Secondly, quietly developing the sources that I need for funding because political campaigns don't run off air. And then the third <laughs> consideration is what's about to happen on November the second. I am cautiously optimistic that on November the 2nd, the American people are going to make a statement. And that is that they are tired of politicians as usual, they are tired of politics as usual, and the appetite of the American electorate might be for a problem solver instead of a politician. And that's what I've done most of my life. Herman, what makes you want to run for president at this time right here, right now? Let's say you do prayerfully consider and, and, you, and the answer is thumbs up, yes, let's go. What, what's motivating you want to run for president of the United States? The thing that motivates me most is the sense that I have to. A good friend of mine reminded me when he asked me, do you want to run for president? I said, no. He said, if you want to run, you're an idiot. He said, and I don't think you're an idiot. He said, but you are driven by the desire, feeling that you have to run. Ron, I can't sit and watch the news every day and read about 15 million people being unemployed, an economy that is stuck on stop, businesses that are so uncertain about the future that they, are, won't, they won't invest, and I don't blame them, and not try and do something about it. Everybody has different talents and different abilities. And so when I looked at the things that I've been blessed with in terms of talents and abilities, I said, why not? This is something that I feel like I have to do if I make the decision to do it. Do you think President Obama is doing what's happening now in this country accidentally because he doesn't know any better, or is this intentional, what's happening? in our country right now. And I know it may not matter to a lot of people because it's right. happening, right. Um, but, but some people are questioning the intent right now of our uh, commander in chief. I think that President Obama is so motivated by believing that he is right, by believing that socialism is right for this country, that he is not looking at what's really happening. He's only looking at the ideology that's stuck in his head about what he thinks America ought to look like. And this Tea Party event and all of the others that have been going on around the country is an emphatic statement that Mr. Obama, your, your vision of the future for America is wrong. That's what this is all about. You're going to be up there speaking here in just a little bit. So, okay, we'll let you go up there. Herman Cain, good luck to you. Thank you, Ron. Congratulations, thank you, and prayerfully considering. Prayerfully considering running for president of the United States in 2012. Thanks a lot, Ron. Thank you very much, Herman. I'm Ron Futrell, Liberty.com, Tea Party HD.